goals I have for myself this month is to get a lot more comfortable with just vlogging. So I am going to go save Kevin because his car battery died down in Seattle Center. And he doesn't have a jumper cable or anybody to help him. So I am going to go um, take my car, help him jump his battery, and then take his car home. And then from there, I'll just leave the car home and walk around and go to the mall. But yeah. So my eyes look a little better now, but last night they were just like so in so much pain. Like it was really hard to like stare at anything bright. Looking at my phone was really painful as well. So I decided to just take a day off today. And my eyes are feeling so much better. I'm trying to not look as look at my phone so much either and just really give myself a technology break. But yeah, that's that. Just letting my car warm up now and then we'll be on our way to Kevin. Peace. I just got done doing my makeup. I am going out and grabbing lunch with one of my girlfriends. And oh my gosh, so I just bought these new lashes from Ulta because they had a, sh a sale and they're these Eyelor lashes. And I think they were like under $10 and look at them. They're so nice. They're super curled and they just make my eyes look so big. I feel like I just found like the perfect lashes for my eyes if I want to do like a dramatic look. Look at that. But yeah, just wanted to share that. So excuse me, my house is still like a total mess, but I think this is gonna be my outfit for today. I wanted to wear a summery dress, but it's still super cold outside, so he's layered up with like a little turtleneck or like a mock neck shirt. So I have my makeup done, but I never really know what to do with my hair. Um, I don't really know how to style it other than just leaving it as is or I don't know, just curling it. So people with long hair, what do you guys do to style your hair? Because I don't really know what to do. And yeah, I don't really know how to use hair products or the only thing I use is like leaving um, conditioner and heat protectant. But other than that, what can I do to my hair? So one of the nice things about Bellevue is that it's super walkable everywhere. So I'm grabbing lunch with a girlfriend today and the restaurant's literally like just 0.7 miles away so I can just walk there. And it's just a super nice day out as well, like the skies are blue. So yeah, spring is almost here. This is Tanisha. I'm getting a lunch with her. <laughs> she got a black eye. Why? I was like looking in the mirror. I don't want eyeshadow today and I realized Did you feel it then or was it no, just... I was just... I was in the moment, you know? <laughs> So this is a um, riz egg tofu with pork and veggies. Yeah. And then pickled radish fried rice. And then three spiced chicken. Yum. I feel like this one's definitely more like traditional Taiwanese. Yeah. And then these are just like it looks super saucy. I love saucy stuff, so that's good. Yeah, but yeah. Like traditional. <laughs> Let's eat. Yum. So we are gonna do a little unboxing because I think my Coachella tickets just came in the mail today. Where the scissors are. <laughs> Why is this so hard to open? There it is. Oh, why is the box so much thinner this year? What is it? I'm really just blink. Oh. oh no, my box is like dented. And it ripped. This is the box. Um, my box came like really ripped and just like fucked up and dented, which is kind of sad. Um, I've never gotten a fucked up box before. It comes with the, you know, Coachella car decal. And then this is what was holding the wristband. There's that. And there's just this little pamphlet that tells you who's playing, just like how to get you know, just the deets. And then we got these, which I'm not really, I'm kind of confused. I'm not really sure how to use them. Um, there's not really any directions or anything. So yeah, I don't know what to do with these. I think they're a calendar. Every year it's a calendar. 
But yeah, that's kind of lame. I'm a little butthurt. Um, this year's box kind of sucks. <laughs> well, oh well, we're still going. We're just hanging out in Ikea today looking for some stuff to buy for Kevin's apartment. And we're down to like the last two really small items and we cannot locate them anywhere. Uh -huh. All the ledges are going to be over there. Okay, thank you. Thank you. It's kind of funny because all the employees here are really just like, I'm not really restocking. I'm just here and waiting for people to ask for directions and where to go. Ooh, is this a trash can? No, it's broken. We're on a mission. Oh, there they are, the Moslandos. I just lost him at Ikea. Just finally found him again. You were stolen. <laughs> I know. Okay, let's get your lamps right here. The right one? Yep, it's Moslanda. Where? You can see it says Moslanda. Because there's nothing on the shelf. Dude, if you ever started a YouTube channel, your followers would think like, damn, you're going to dumb as fuck. <laughs> you question everything. You, you do question everything, yeah. though. Learn to question everything. <laughs> okay, what else do we need? Do we really want to go back upstairs to get the... What? The lining? <laughs> Let's see what's in here. A massive pen. Can you be banned from Ikea? I don't know, you wanna try? Yeah. <laughs> I've been waiting for this. Yum. <laughs> well, look at that. I got a new tripod. Very nice, very nice. Cool. Nice. Okay, now I can actually feel comfortably. I know. Hello. Hi, Gaston. Good boy. Hi, Gaston. Hello. Oh, okay. Hi. Hi, Kane. Hello. Oh, okay. You stick your nose in there, why don't you? It's for the vlog. Hello. Let's go. Guess who's getting an award today? That guy. Dude, they have to put an ice cube. Moving on to the class of the year. So, um, I want to recognize Kevin Chang. Number one, he had a production increase over his previous year of 138 percent. I recognize Kevin Chang. Congratulations. <laughs> Having dinner at Sea Star tonight. He's in the gift card the Main Street gave us. Look how cute these desserts are. They're like little Pokemons. This is like the. This is the. I know what you think. I know what you think. No, it's. Yeah, it's like a leaf grass type. That's a grass type Pokemon. It looks like Chikorita. I know what you're thinking. Chikorita. It seems Chikorita. It's a little green, like, and it evolves in a bay leaf. I don't know. It looks kind of like. Well, what type? This looks like a a snow type Pokemon. All right, just eat. <laughs> it's so cute. 
No, it doesn't work. Are you serious? Yeah. So yes, this is my new couch. I'm so excited, it's fitting into the decor really nicely. I've always wanted a kind of like a velvet couch. This is a gray distressed velvet. And yeah, I'm so excited. Everything's slowly coming together. So I need to sell my two coffee tables, get a TV stand and a coffee table, and we're set. Two and a five, you know, like, and you have like yeah, I have an audio contributor. Look at me, look at me, Kevin. Double fist. Double fist. Triple fist. Double fist. Double fist. Double fist. Everyone. Hey. Oh yeah, let's take pictures of him. Where's the Polaroid camera? Should I put on flash? I never know what to do. Uh, it's, I don't know when they did the this. Yeah, you're like, okay, those are like Yeah. I'm getting one more, Kevin. I'll get from below. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Kevin. Happy birthday to you. Gotta get all of them. <laughs> What is it? Bottles? Yeah, I have to drink two and a half gallons of water a day. <laughs> that probably makes it a lot easier though. <laughs> Dude, I can't keep track. <laughs> I have to keep track as well. Whatever that what is that like a hair touch up day? Gonna go get my hair touched up in preparation for Coachella in a week or two. So yeah. I'm watching some YouTube right now as well. So I'm just finishing up my makeup um, so I can go to run to my appointment. I have to run to Kevin's workplace and grab his keys since my car was having problems yesterday. And it's too dangerous to drive it, so yeah. And the funny thing is Kevin's car is having battery issues too, so we're both kind of gambling with both our cars and just trying to make it to places about, you know, in one piece. Yeah, right now I'm just putting on some eyeshadow, just something super simple, so I can get out of the house and just run some errands. But yeah, yesterday we had Kevin's little birthday party. My family's really big on if you don't blow out birthday candles on your birthday, it's not a real birthday. So I got him a little cake and invited a couple friends over, had my mom over, Kevin's roommate Jack, and we just kind of had like. A fun little celebration with like six people. 
it was actually really nice because you like get to talk to people and everyone's engaging in the same conversation versus like when you have a big party everyone's kind of doing their own thing you know but yeah that was nice we had some 85 degrees uh, I picked up a cake and yeah and everybody left around 10 and we just called it and I appreciate all my friends that just you know come out no matter what whether it's like birthdays or just getting a little get together super appreciative that I have that I have something like that in my life Sweet. currently putting on just doing like a light wash on my eyelids of the shade puree from the Too Faced Sweet Peach palette this is one of my favorite palettes um, this is actually one of my favorite browns to put on my eyes as well it's very nice like sienna warm brown and it's like super blendable so I just really like to it gives the illusion that I have like deeper eye sockets for highlighters, which is the Doll Light Duo palette. And I believe I don't know, I'm wearing Supernova, and it's just so fucking bright. I love it. I love it. It's so bright. But yeah, other things on my agenda is just getting my hair done, and then we're trying to go out tonight. I'm not really in the mood to drink just because I've been really good with my diet and just working out and I've seen yeah, I feel like I haven't done much this March to like I don't know I'll have to look back on all my footage but March was just spending a lot of time at home um Kevin was packing up his stuff to move out he moved, he moved across the street with his roommate uh, which is really nice. Nothing's wrong about our relationship or anything. It's just that it's nice for me to have my own space and for him to have his own space Just because I do do a lot of my work from home Or well, not a lot of my work all of my work from home. So it's just nice to have like a distraction free environment sometimes So yeah, it's really nice to have him have his own place and it just gives me time to focus on my things and film as well but yeah, so a lot of March was just helping him move out to his place, and we were just busy every weekend. He worked a lot of weekends. I didn't really have time to go out and like shoot any pictures or do anything fun either. Um, but we did go hang out with friends a couple times. I think I have some footage of that. Hopefully, it's enough to you know make like a March vlog of things. You know, some of the Ico lash alert. I've been using this ever since I did it in my first impressions video. Yeah, with just my graph design work lately too, I feel like there's been like a slowdown in projects which allows me to like work on my own projects as well, but like sometimes I just feel like I want to do something different, you know? Like I want to do videos and instead of just working on assignments, but then again, it's just what I need to do to make money and be able to afford rent and, you know, a place to live and food. And this month was, def was definitely a scary month. I do feel like I overspent because I had to, I don't know. I haven't had all my invoices for this month. Like, I haven't gotten all my paychecks yet, but I feel like I did not, I overspent this month. So I gotta be better on that. But then it kind of makes sense just cause I recently just moved into my own place and getting a lot of my own furniture and stuff does cost a lot of money. I want to get better with my spending too, not eating out as much, not like buying unnecessary things I don't need. It's kind of annoying. But yeah, this is, this is the look. I'm going to douse myself in setting spray now. Oh fuck, my eyes are open. Back at the salon, getting my nasty old roots touched up. Like yeah. Let's do this. So I went into the salon this morning, realized not realizing how yellow my hair had gone over the last month because I was using the wrong shampoo. So yeah, just got my hair redid today. We went like a smidge a bit ashier, but look at that. This is so. This is so much more me than my other hair. So please, if you ever see my hair getting really like yellow, let me know. It's not how it's supposed to be, but yeah. Look at this, I am just so happy with it. Anna always does a freaking amazing job. So yeah, yee! I'm so excited to go out tonight now. <laughs> Birthday. 
Lotte boy. I could totally hear. Where are we going? In 100 feet. It was a surprise. Uh oh. Okay, Siri. Look at that. It's a glass skewer. Yeah, <laughs> get it? So much concentration, much focus. Don't mess up, don't mess up. All right, Kevin, give me a review of your monkfish. My first time eating monkfish, I've never really, but never really had it. What does it taste like? What fish is it similar to? You're very good at chewy. describing. It's very chewy. It's chewy. Happy birthday. <laughs> Make a wish. <laughs>